Be okay, before this video starts, I would like to apologize for all the big lag spikes that were in this video, so... Yeah, this was really the only recording I had of this, so I apologize for that. And so, yeah. So, welcome to another episode of my Let's Play of the Crew Beta, and... There's about two episodes left of the Crew Beta. And so, yeah. Today we're going to be customizing some of my dirt spec cars. And so, just making them look bit more unique and crazy and stuff and so yeah there's some crazy rally lights on the cars I mean I just took a look at all the bumpers just for the fun of it this one I liked quite a bit just without the light bars and stuff like that those were nice but since this is a rally car it needs these rally lights because all the rally cars have rally lights on them that stupid spoiler is going to go away la later. Of course, changing the bumper. Now with this bumper, I was cycling back and forth because I couldn't figure out, I couldn't see a difference between these two. I mean, they were practically identical. I mean, they were pretty much identical. There was no difference I could see with them, really. I mean, yeah, the same exact reverse lights, though. Yeah, no difference with those. Yeah, they're practically the same, I mean. I don't remember which one I actually went for. I think I went for this one. So yeah, major lag. For some reason I have lag. I had a bunch of lag in this portion of this portion of this in this area so yeah put that bumper on it's great to mess with wing stock wing oh Jim Connor wing yeah that Jim Connor wing life bro that's not even a Jim Connor wing actually it's more like a rally wing for the Ford focuses and the stock wing that one looks a lot better oddly enough they have that wing available for these cars and of course I want the hood with the snorkel on it yes it's cutting through the rally lights a little in a demo mode that's kinda weird yes oh yes now it's ready for scuba diving hello well I didn't really customize my cars with stickers because I didn't even bother also, there's different versions of interior things. You can have carbon fiber inlays, you can have aluminum inlays, you can have carbon fiber and aluminum. And so, yeah, just doing a little bit of a different interior color for this thing. And so, yeah, done with this. Now let's customize my Mustang. Oops, excuse me. Where's the Stang? There's the Stang. The little rally lights look a little weird on the grill, so... Time to fix those, first of all, interior. So yeah, just... Yeah, get those. Or not. Major lag. I apologize. Your eyes are prop. Your... The viewer's eyes are probably... Have... Yep, the viewer's eyes have probably been destroyed. Your eyes have been destroyed. Ooh. The GT500 front lights on that bumper. That's kind of cool. I actually like those lights. So yeah, rear bumper. I don't understand why this, when you get the little uh, kind of like piece between the tail lights, you get the little DeLorean thing on the back as well. I don't understand why that is. But yeah. A bit weird looking with the DeLorean thing on the back, but and then the wing. Oh heck, heck no! Wish you could take that wing completely off. Oh, you know we're going with the snorkel. I'm going with that snorkel. Even though it makes the car look a little weird, but these dirt spec cars are actually weird as it is. So yeah, and now I'm going to take, just looking through the colors real fast. 
Yeah, I actually like the Mustang in blue, not really red, but I don't know why I got it in red. But anyway, I'm gonna take it, them both out and take a look at how they look. And so yeah, and there we are. It's oddly enough, the headlights are exactly like the real Mustang GT500, but the dirt spec one it looks pretty good actually. The keep getting a random Skype call, Skype things. So anyway, yeah, there's that. There's my Focus RS. Ah, my eyes. Those are actually pretty bright, surprisingly, for a game like this. But yeah, oh god, lag spike. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Thanks for watching, and again, I'm sorry for the lag. Bye.